Good morning, Traitorous. How are you doing? Uh, awesome. Uh, oh, okay. Where is it? Uh, Sweet. Let's go in here. He just keeps giving me presents all the time. And oh my goodness. What is this? A whole 2x4 stack of diamond ore. This is incredible. So let's just mine it up. What? Traitorous? What's wrong with you? Uh. Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod showcase where today we're going to be taking a look at the Boom Plus mod which adds in some really cool explosions and also explosive items into your Minecraft game. I'm all kitted up in my diamond armor ready to be protected so without further ado let's get straight to it. So over in this chest here I have all of the items included in this mod but first we need to go over two very special ores. The first one radioactive or and the second one is blaze or now I am gonna take these into the testing chamber and you'll see why in a second because this is gonna get a little bit crazy so let's start off with the less crazy radioactive or and this is exactly what it looks like it's kind of like a dotty green on smooth stone and when you mine it up you will get some really really cool green kind of glowstone dust looking stuff but this is actually called radioactive gunpowder now you use this in some really important recipes in this mod which we'll take a look at later so let's move on to blaze or now i'm just gonna plop one in here as you can see when you find it you're definitely it's not gonna be easy to miss is it there's just there's the fire coming out of it left right and center but even more so when you mine it oh god a blaze comes out so you need to be very very careful because this blaze will attack you and um it's gonna be crazy so be very very careful about this the only thing is i've only got a pickaxe to destroy this but it worked pretty well Oh, that was surprising. So when you mine it, you will get three blaze powder and then whatever the drops from the blaze are. But this will only be found in the nether. And um, yeah, it dropped blaze powder, which is really cool. I just thought it was really unique because when you place it down, it just looks super awesome with all those flames. You can just place it around your house and make it look amazing. Nom, 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 So let's move on to the next items in this mod. Now, the first one is a set of blocks that are very, very sneaky, which is perfectly explained in the name because it is called Sneaky Boom. And there's four different variants. So the first one is Sneaky Boom Stone. Then we've got Sneaky Boom Iron, then Gold, and then we've got Diamond as well. So let's just drag these into our inventory. And I'm not sure how well this is going to go, but we're going to go outside and find out. Is it going to rain? Oh, it looks like it's it's gone. Is it passed? We need to be very careful though, because there's probably stuff that spawned outside. This is this is going to be crazy. Oh my goodness, this is going to be yeah. There, there's stuff that spawned outside. So let's be very very careful. But we're going to take a look at these sneaky boom. So first off, to craft them, you're going to need whatever material you're going to need for the actual sneaky boom. So say you're making a stone one, and you want to wrap one piece of TNT in stone. Say you want an iron one, you're going to want to wrap iron ingots around a TNT. Gold for gold, and then diamonds for diamonds. So it's very very expensive for the diamond one, but they do a similar thing so the first one is the stone one let's mine this up three two one and it creates an explosion now i'm going to put these next to each other to try and compare the explosion so let's go for the diamond one now and see if this explosion is even more oh geez yeah it definitely is <laughs> so the more powerful or the more rare the ore is then the more powerful the explosion is going to be then we got iron boom oh that one was pretty big as well oh geez that was huge and then we've got gold as well whoa well, so the iron one's actually one of the cheapest. It's the second second cheapest, I think. And um, it actually drops a nice amount of explosions. And you've also get the ore back as well, just in case you wanted to use it. So there you go. Sneaky booms that you can use and prank your friends with. I nom, 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 You always catch me having a snack, guys, always. So um, in this chest, we have a final few items. These are the main ones in here. But first, we're going to go over the cool glasses, the boom jacket, and the detonator. Now, these ones are very, very very dangerous well these are these are the cool glasses and why do we wear these because cool guys never look at explosions why can't i wear them I, oh you can't even wear no that's not fair that's not fair i can't wear them right now but if you hold them in your hand and walk away from an explosion you're gonna look pretty awesome not as awesome as if you were wearing them though Ah, but then we move on to the boom jacket and the detonator. So let's put the diamond helmet back on and we can't actually wear the boom jacket. So we're going to leave the diamond chest plate on. And what happens is, is literally what you're going to expect. So this jacket is literally something you hold in your inventory. And when you pair it with the detonator, 
you become your very own kind of suicide bomber style of um of explosion so three two one boom oh geez that was crazy <laughs> so it gets used up and then explosion follows so it gets taken out of your inventory and you get a huge explosion but if you're not wearing armor you probably will die i took about three or four hearts of damage when i was affected with um diamond armor so a very powerful explosion which should be awesome to troll your friends with as well and now we move oh wait wait i'm a little bit hungry let me just nom let me just nom 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 there we go nice and full because i need to prepare myself for this because we've got all of these explosive to take a look at we've got small boom Boom, medium boom, large boom, massive boom, and then three special ones, which are magic boom, radioactive boom, and nether boom. I've never said boom so much in my life, but these are all crafted in different ways. I'll skip that for now because you can check that out in the description below. But let's get to exploding some awesome things. Now, I thought we'd do something really special. Seeing as we've taken all our decorations down from Christmas, and Christmas has been and gone, I think we should go and sort out the North Pole of these explosions. What do you think, Treyarus? Uh. Awesome. I will meet you there. Welcome guys to the North Pole where we are back, but we're in creative mode because we're going to get seriously creative with some explosives today. I'm sorry, Mr. Snowman, but you're going to be up first. We're going to test this out because Christmas is officially over. So um, we thought we'd give Santa and his elves something to work towards next next year. Oh dear, these elves have gone a little bit weird. Maybe he's employing Minecraft mobs. But anyway, let's try out these explosions. The first one is small boom, and we're going to try this one on the poor little snowman. So let's put some redstone down here, and I think this is an instant explosion, so... Oh dear. Three, two, one... Oh yeah, it was instant. That's awesome. So you don't get the warning at all like you do with normal TNT. And it's blown the front off this poor little snowman right then. We're going to have to go one step further and go for the medium boom on this guy. That one is smoking. That one I am worried about. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> oh jeez, that exploded me so far backwards and the snowman is almost gone. Oh dear, I think we should leave him alone for now, even though there's only like one eye and a bit of his arm left. Right then, let's move along. What else could we take down? Um, I'm going to do the Christmas tree last. Let's go for this here. What is this? What is this? This is um, Buddy's Sweet Shack. So um, we're going to have to go for a large boom on this one, I'm afraid, Buddy. And let's take a little bit of a, a run up to this one. Um, let's make it go along here. And here we go. This is it. The, the, the large boom. Three, two, one. Oh! It took the whole house out. A little bit of lag, as expected. But it even took out the basement. It took out the basement and the whole house with a large boom. Right then. Massive boom is up next. And I think this one's going to have to be for the Christmas tree. So um, let me see if I can make a little bit of a run up to here. So we're going to go uh, for this. And then we're going to lead some redstone up here. Here we go. Let's just make a little path for it so we can see what's going on. Um, here we go. This is going to be amazing. Guys, this is going to be incredible. Right then, let's move this all the way along to here. And then put the lever down. And three, two, one. Oh! <laughs> that was absolutely huge. It definitely lives up to his name. Massive boom. And it took out the bottom, the whole bottom half of the Christmas tree. The Christmas tree now has no butt. Wow. <laughs> right then, up next is the magic boom. Now, what should we take out next? We're slowly destroying this. Actually, we're quickly destroying this. And I think we should go for this one because we've got some friends in here that need sorting out. They're slacking off at work. Let's go for the magic boom. I have no idea what this one does. Let's see how magical it is. Oh. Oh, did it zap lightning? Did it zap lightning? I think it zap lightning. Let's try that once more. That's one more time. Let's try it on top of the snowman and see if that does actually summon in lightning. Because that would be incredible. Let's try it again. That's that's redstone. I need to leave a three, two, one. Boom. Yeah, it does. It zaps lightning. That's incredible. Right then, we've got two more booms left. The first is radioactive. The second is nether. Let's go for let's go for nether first. This one should be interesting. So let's go for this right here first and we're gonna put a lever on the side and go oh no oh that's so loud oh that is incredibly loud oh geez <laughs> so it brings the nether to the overworld or to wherever you decide to explode this so let's try it out by itself and see what happens yeah it just brings blazes and lava and oh no and ghasts as well pretty much the three worst things in the nether apart from the wither skeletons here we go this is going to get very, very messy. So we might as well end on the biggest boom of all, the radioactive boom. And this one is crafted with the radioactive dust that we discovered earlier. And let's put it between these two candy canes. Ready, 
So, oh, that looks, that looks amazing. I love those particles. Very, very cool. Let's go. Oh, did you hear the gas scream? He was upset. And there we go. You can see why. It makes a massive explosion in the floor. A big square. And it adds lava as well. Absolutely terrifying. So, North Pole, until next year, we'll, we'll see you then. <laughs> Trust, that was super fun. You would have enjoyed that a lot. So you're going to have to come and um, play with some TNT with me in a second. So that is pretty much the mod. It's a really cool explosives mod. Really quick, really simple to install and use. And it can make you explode absolutely anything. So if you enjoyed this mod and would like to use it for yourself, then please do go in the description below and check it out. And also, this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, then please do consider subscribing and joining Team TDM today, as well as leaving a big, fat like if you did enjoy exploding the North Pole. So thank you everyone for watching, and I will see you all next time. Thank you so much for playing some Minecraft with us today. Goodbye! Good morning, Traitorous. How are you doing? Uh, awesome. Uh, oh, okay. Where is it? Uh, Sweet. Let's go in here. He just keeps giving me presents all the time. And oh my goodness. What is this? A whole 2x4 stack of diamond ore. This is incredible. So let's just mine it up. What? Traitorous? What's wrong with you? Uh. Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod showcase where today we're going to be taking a look at the Boom Plus mod which adds in some really cool explosions and also explosive items into your Minecraft game. I'm all kitted up in my diamond armor ready to be protected so without further ado let's get straight to it. So over in this chest here I have all of the items included in this mod but first we need to go over two very special ores. The first one radio active ore and the second one is blaze ore. Now I am going to take these into the testing chamber and you'll see why in a second because this is going to get a little bit crazy. So let's start off with the less crazy radioactive ore and this is exactly what it looks like. It's kind of like a dotty green on smooth stone and when you mine it up you will get some really really cool green kind of glowstone dust looking stuff but this is actually called radioactive gunpowder. Now you use this in some really important recipes in this mod which we'll take a look at later so let's move on to blaze or now i'm just gonna plop one in here as you can see when you find it you're definitely it's not gonna be easy to miss is it there's just there's the fire coming out of it left right and center but even more so when you mine it oh god a blaze comes out so you need to be very very careful because this blaze will attack you and um it's gonna be crazy so be very very careful about this the only thing is i've only got a pickaxe to destroy this but it worked pretty well Oh, that was surprising. So when you mine it, you will get three blaze powder and then whatever the drops from the blaze are. But this will only be found in the nether. And um, yeah, it dropped blaze powder, which is really cool. I just thought it was really unique because when you place it down, it just looks super awesome with all those flames. You can just place it around your house and make it look amazing. Nom, 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 So let's move on to the next items in this mod. Now, the first one is a set of blocks that are very, very sneaky, which is perfectly explained in the name because it is called Sneaky Boom. And there's four different variants. So the first one is Sneaky Boom Stone. Then we've got Sneaky Boom Iron, then Gold, and then we've got Diamond as well. So let's just drag these into our inventory. And I'm not sure how well this is going to go, but we're going to go outside and find out. Is it going to rain? Oh, it looks like it's it's gone. Is it passed? We need to be very careful though, because there's probably stuff that spawned outside. This is this is gonna be crazy. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be yeah, there, there's stuff that spawned outside. So let's be very, very careful, but we're gonna take a look at these sneaky booms. So, first off, to craft them, you're gonna need whatever material you're going to need for the actual sneaky boom. So, say you're making a stone one and you want to wrap one piece of TNT in stone. Say you want an iron one, you're gonna want to wrap iron ingots around a TNT, gold for gold, and then diamonds for diamonds. So it's very, very expensive for the diamond one, but they do a similar thing. So the first one is the stone one. Let's mine this up. Three, two, one. And it creates an explosion. Now I'm going to put these next to each other to try and compare the explosion. So let's go for the diamond one now and see if this explosion is even more. Oh geez. Yeah, it definitely is. <laughs> so the more powerful or the more rare the ore is, then the more powerful the explosion is going to be. Then we got iron. 
Boom. Oh, that one was pretty big as well. Oh, geez, that was huge. And then we've got gold as well. Whoa. Wow, so the iron one's actually one of the cheapest. It's the second second cheapest, I think. And um, it actually drops a nice amount of explosions. And you have also get the ore back as well, just in case you wanted to use it. So there you go. Sneaky booms that you can use and prank your friends with. Oh, nom, 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 nom. You always catch me having a snack, guys, always. So um, in this chest, we have a final few items. These are the main ones in here. But first, we're going to go over the cool glasses, the boom jacket, and the detonator. Now, these ones are very, very very dangerous well these aren't these are the cool glasses and why do we wear these because cool guys never look at explosions why can't i wear them I, oh you can't even wear no that's not fair that's not fair i can't wear them right now but if you hold them in your hand and walk away from an explosion you're gonna look pretty awesome not as awesome as if you were wearing them though Ah. But then we move on to the boom jacket and the detonator. So let's put the diamond helmet back on. And we can't actually wear the boom jacket, so we're going to leave the diamond chest plate on. And what happens is, is literally what you're going to expect. So this jacket is literally something you hold in your inventory. And when you pair it with the detonator... You become your very own kind of suicide bomber style of um, of explosion. So three, two, one, boom. Oh, geez, that was crazy. <laughs> so it gets used up and an explosion follows. So it gets taken out of your inventory and you get a huge explosion. But if you're not wearing armor, you... Good morning, Traitorous. How are you doing? Uh, awesome. Uh, oh, okay. Where is it? Uh, Sweet. Let's go in here. He just keeps giving me presents all the time. And oh, my goodness. What is this? A whole 2x4 stack of diamond ore. This is incredible. So let's just mine it up. What? Traoris? What's wrong with you? Ah. Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod showcase where today we're going to be taking a look at the Boom Plus mod which adds in some really cool explosions and also explosive items into your Minecraft game. I'm all kitted up in my diamond armor ready to be protected so without further ado let's get straight to it. So over in this chest here I have all of the items included in this mod but first we need to go over two very special ores. The first one radio active ore and the second one is this will only be found in the nether and um yeah it dropped blaze powder which is really cool i just thought it was really unique because when you place it down it just looks super awesome with all those flames you can just place it around your house and make it look amazing nom 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 so let's move on to the next items in this mod now the first one is a set of blocks that are very very sneaky which is perfectly explained in the name because it is called sneaky boom and there's four different variants so the first one is sneaky boom stone then we've got sneaky boom iron then gold and then we've got diamond as well so let's just drag these into our inventory and i'm not sure how well this is gonna go but we're gonna go outside and find out is it gonna rain oh it looks like it's it's gone is it passed we need to be very careful though because there's probably stuff that spawned outside this is this is gonna be crazy oh my goodness this is gonna be yeah there, there's stuff that spawned outside so let's be very very careful but we're gonna take a look at these sneaky boom so first off to craft them you're gonna need whatever material you're going to need for the actual sneaky boom so say you're making a stone one and you want to wrap one piece of tnt in stone say you want an iron one you're gonna want to wrap iron ingots around a tnt gold for gold and then diamonds for diamonds so it's very very expensive for the diamond one but they do a similar thing so the first one is the stone one let's mine this up three two one and it creates an explosion now i'm going to put these next to each other to try and compare the explosion so let's go for the diamond one now and see if this explosion is even more oh geez yeah it definitely is <laughs> so the more powerful or the more rare the ore is then the more powerful the explosion is going to be then we got iron boom oh that one was pretty big as well oh geez that was huge and then we've got gold as well whoa well, so the iron one's actually one of the cheapest. It's the second second cheapest, I think. And um, it actually drops a nice amount of explosions. And you also get the ore back as well, just in case you wanted to use it. So there you go. Sneaky booms that you can use and prank your friends with. Oh, nom, 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 nom. You always catch me having a snack, guys, always. So um, in this chest, we have a final few items. These are the main ones in here. But first, we're going to go over the cool glasses, the boom jacket, and the detonator. Now, these ones are very very dangerous well these aren't these are the cool glasses and why do we wear these because cool guys never look at explosions why can't i wear them 
I, oh, you can't even wear... No, that's not fair. That's not fair. I can't wear them right now. But if you hold them in your hand and walk away from an explosion, you're going to look pretty awesome. Not as awesome as if you were wearing them, though. Ah. But then we move on to the boom jacket and the detonator. So let's put the diamond helmet back on. And we can't actually wear the boom jacket, so we're going to leave the diamond chest plate on. And what happens is, is literally what you're going to expect. So this jacket is literally something you hold in your inventory. And when you pair it with the detonator, you become your very own kind of suicide bomber style of, um, of explosion. So three, two, one... Boom! Oh, geez, that was crazy. <laughs> so it gets used up, and an explosion follows. So it gets taken out of your inventory, and you get a huge explosion. But if you're not wearing armor, you probably will die. Blaze or Now, I am going to take these into the testing chamber, and you'll see why in a second, because this is going to get a little bit crazy. So let's start off with the less crazy radioactive ore, and this is exactly what it looks like. It's kind of like a dotty green on smooth stone, and when you mine it up, you will get some really, really pretty cool green kind of glowstone dust looking stuff but this is actually called radioactive gunpowder now you use this in some really important recipes in this mod which we'll take a look at later so let's move on to blaze or now i'm just gonna plop one in here as you can see when you find it you're definitely it's not gonna be easy to miss is it there's just there's the fire coming out of it left right and center but even more so when you mine it Oh god, a blaze comes out. So you need to be very, very careful because this blaze will attack you and um, it's going to be crazy. So be very, very careful about this. The only thing is, I've only got a pickaxe to destroy this, but it worked pretty well. Oh, that was surprising. So when you mine it, you will get three blaze powder and then whatever the drops from the blaze are. But 